So hey friends, I came over here and bugged my friend Tom for a little tour of his Ford Transit. It's so cute. So he's just straightening it up a little bit and then he said he'd show us around. So Tom, show me around your transit. Tell me a little bit about it. Okay, it's a 2013 Ford Transit Connect. Uh, it's a, it's imported from Europe. Uh, they used to call, and they've been making, Ford's been making minivans since World War II in England. And, and so it's part of that heritage. And um, it has, you know, it opens up on both sides. That's nice. And I, I haven't gotten around to insulating the walls or anything, so it's just a regular cargo van. I put down a rug that I, uh, area rug that I got from Walmart, and I trimmed it to fit. And and so that quiet, that insulates it, makes it more quiet inside. And I just bought a uh, full uh, cot from Amazon. I measured how long it you know how it needed to be in the what do they call it um a narrow twin is what it is uh-huh and um then i had and then i cut a uh, memory foam twin mattress down to fit it uh you can probably order a a uh, narrow twin memory foam but i had one already so i trimmed it down there you go <laughs> and then so uh the way I, a simple way i have it uh, electric is this uh, is is designed and I ordered it off of Amazon it's just a little waterproof uh, extension it's the male male part of a uh, extension cord uh -huh. and then you plug your female cord part of the cord in here on the inside oh. you just have a little it just has the other end of the cord oh nice so you can plug the electric heater in there or uh -huh. a phone charger whatever I probably eventually what I'm gonna do is make put up mount a um, that electrical strip that yeah a little power strip or, yeah there you go yep on the wall that way I'll have multiple outlets there yeah and then this one this I guess the basic cargo already has a headliner so it has a little bit of insulation inside and my system is uh, just milk crates in the back you can get four milk crates underneath it and you can just pull them out okay. and, and uh, put them back in there fairly easily and uh -huh. it holds a ton of stuff. I have these longer crates. Mm -hmm. I have two and so you can reach one from this side and one from the other side. Yeah. I put all the kitchen stuff in those up for, up for in front of the bed. Very good. So what, what kind of gas mileage does do you uh, get? They claim that the new ones get upwards of 40. Uh -huh. this, but this is older with 80,000 miles. So it's been averaging 25 to 27. And like I said, I just bought it a couple of months ago. So I don't I haven't done a lot of maintenance. I'm going to have, you know, spark plugs changed and all that. So that uh -huh. should increase. And I'm kind of a lead foot anyway. I, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Get so there. that doesn't help either. And it, it's uh, built on the Ford uh, Focus chassis. Okay. And the, I don't know if I mentioned it, but the 2000 reason why I went with 2013, it was the last year that we had a, a high top. Oh, okay. All of the newer ones are regular minivan uh -huh. uh, high roof. So I can't stand up all the way i have to bend them you know like this yeah but it gives you enough room to change you know clothes yeah. and all that stuff so yeah, that's basically it let's see uh, oh yeah i was going to show it also show that i have a little stool that i can sit there number three next to the bed uh -huh. when i need to put on my shoes or whatever oh that's very cool <laughs> or huddle very in cool. front of the heater uh-huh <laughs> <laughs> awesome but, well i hope you <laughs> hope you have lots of fun adventures uh, in it I'm sure I will. <laughs> we'll get all this traffic going by. <laughs> <Great wave. laughs> Thank you, Tom. You're welcome. Right. My pleasure.